Hello, I'm Dr. Richard Gain, one of the physicians at Clinithink, and I lead the clinical terminology team responsible for maintaining the Clix engine. I'm going to demonstrate a new application jointly developed by Recognosco and Clinithink, which integrates speech recognition and structured data entry using natural language processing. I'm going to dictate into the right-hand window here, labelled unstructured text input, and you'll see the structured data appearing on the left-hand side in real time. Presenting complaint, colon, headache. New paragraph, history, colon, the patient is a 15-year-old female presenting with occipital headache for the last six hours. Full stop. She denies trauma. Full stop. She has been intermittently nauseated but has not vomited and has some photophobia. Full stop. Denies fever. Full stop. No other visual symptoms. Full stop. Assessment. Colon. Photophobia and nausea make migraine the most likely diagnosis. New paragraph. Plan, colon, paracetamol with codeine, PRN, for pain. Well, hopefully you'll have seen there that uh, most of the text that I've dictated has been correctly recognised using the uh, speech recognition engine. But also, uh, at the same time, the free text has been converted into structured data. Importantly, the context has been maintained so that where the symptoms are present, um, they are mar marked as such, but also the negative symptoms are also recorded and negated. In the family history section, the allergy to penicillin is in the mother and uh, the cerebral aneurysm uh, is linked to the grandmother. The patient has no known penicillin allergy, and this has been correctly assigned under the allergies heading. Also uh, worth noting that uh, if I select a diagnosis over on the right-hand side here, you can see that this is also linked to uh, the ICD-9 codes, ICD-10 codes, and also to any external data sources. Uh, we've indexed Wikipedia, which allows us to open articles, but this could equally be to any hospital treatment protocols uh, that were appropriate for the conditions being dictated uh, or recorded in the record. I hope that information is uh, of interest to you and if you would like to know more information please contact us at Clinithink. Thank you for watching.